200 or more demonstrators greeted Quayle in Portland. A noisy lot they were, too, mostly there opposing the administration's policy in Central America. The vice president has taken a leading role in that policy, and he was the target tonight. Before the scuffling was over, two dozen people arrested, about half were trying to force their way into the hotel where Quayle was raising money for the Republican Party. Earlier in Portland, the vice president did a bit of anti-drug work, dropping in on an FBI news conference, announcing the breakup of a Mexican black tar heroin ring. Good pictures and good press for a man the polls say could use a little of both. In Seattle earlier in the day, things were much calmer, though not without their moments. The vice president arrived with Senator Gorton at his side, mindful, no doubt, that Washington was one of the few states the Republicans lost a year ago. The vice president met with Goodwill Games organizers and sponsors. He held a $175 a plate lunch speech, and he spent a bit of time ignoring protesters here, too. Again, the policy, Central America.